Assalamualaikum. Welcome back to this channel. Today we will be showing you this botanic garden which is in the north of the city of Malaga. So uh, this La Concepcion farm has its origin in the union of several farms located on the banks of Guado Medina River which is in the north of the city of Malaga. In this in this garden there are many crops which are like cereals, olive trees, almond trees, vines and citrus. The creators of this garden The creators of this garden are Marcus of Casa Loring, George Loring Oyar Sabal, Amelia Heredia Livermore. These two are the sons of a well-known businessman who came into the city in the search of their fortune. So here on this table we see um, books about the ecosystem for one to three euros. They have some little stickers on them to show their value, the price of them. And here are some postcards, which you can send to someone who lives far away or just keep it as a souvenir. Above it says the price of them. Here's a little store, souvenir store, I guess, with magnets, etc. Here are some picnic tables, well, which people come to eat here when they bring their own food. And then next to it is a little restaurant or cafe where you can buy cakes. Here are some orange flowers which are surrounding this little cafe over here. Here are some people eating and here are the trees. There are, these are a variety of trees here. It's like many trees from China, from India, from Africa. There's many trees we'll, which we will show you on later in this video. So here we're walking around the little cafe. Here is a little pond, which is after the cafe, it's a little place, and here are some little stands which tells us about this pond and place. I guess it's about a flat word. Here are some more trees and flowers. So there are many people in this place. It's really crowded. It's really crowded at the at four o'clock. There's even two people are having picnics here and just enjoying the nature. Here's some more trees and bushes. 
There are some lily pads in the pond. I bet there are fishes in there too, like little tiny ones. Here are some more picnic benches and some more trees. There are so many different trees in this botanic garden. More about this garden would be, so, surrounding this historic garden is the botanical garden, where the plants collection are organized under a scientific criteria. Thus, you can see near the entrance is a collection of aquatic plants, another of prehistoric plants, the rockery of biodiversity, a greenhouse with insectivores, bromelides, and orchids, a collection of African plants and another of bamboos. To the north you can visit the root around the world in 80 trees. So there are 80 different type of trees from around the world and a collection of varieties Malaga I mean a collection of varieties of Malaga's vines and another of olive trees in the area of the plants of our land. The upper strip of the historic garden is crossed by the forest route and that of the viewpoints, both with native plants. In the southern north, most part of the collection of cacti and succulents is located. <laughs> Here are some more pine trees and different trees. So here is a view. So, um, 250 million years ago, plants first began to produce pollen and seeds, which helped them reproduce better. These first plant seeds were gymnosperms, plants that have survived on the planet since then and which a good sample is gathered. So, so in the plot at the entrance of the garden is a collection where, in addition to the well-known ginkgo biloba, you can see many different species of cycas and so... Philarta, Zemia, Dion, and Micro, I mean Macro, Zemia. Okay, so right now we are walking down a path, which leads to something, something extraordinary probably. Let's see. Here are some trees. Lots and lots of trees.
Here is a flower, a plant. So here we are, here is a staircase which leads to something else I guess, you can see there are many people here, on the other side we would see a lot more. Here is a map from around the world, well, off the world. Here is another sign. I think there's some more trees and trees and trees. Here is a huge little lake, or pond as you can say, with many lily pads inside of it. And then next to it is another little pond, and then next to that is a little fountain. In these two little ponds, well, two, one lake and one pond, there is some little fishies, some little fishes inside.
here is some little bushes in a mint here are some little bushes in like a mint color whitish pretty pretty right and here is a little place full of flowers in different shapes many different colors and many different types of flowers Now walking further, we will see a little lake or whatever you would like to call it, which has like some fountains in it and is covered well, surrounded by lots of trees and it's really pretty. Here's some more minty trees, I mean grass, or well, little plants, or bushes. It's really pretty as you walk through it, you can see like green, purple, pink, mint. There are many colors, I think you can see every color in this botanical garden. There's some purple flowers and red flowers and dark red. The purple are the nicest. Some more purple flowers. Now we are walking through some bushy, some bushes and some trees. There are many trees in many different shapes and colors here. Here is the little lake or big lake I was talking about. It's really, really pretty. See, there's a little fountain in there and some little rocks, or well, big rocks in there, and it's really, really clear, the water. Here's what well, here's what is on the other side of the lake. A little uh something that looks like a rocket.
So I guess we are coming to the end of this video. So please like, share, and subscribe to this channel. We will upload the second part tomorrow, if not the day after that. So I hope you like this video and remember to subscribe. Thank you for watching this. I hope you like it. So we will end this video on some cactuses and some other plants. You will see the rest of this video on the video we upload tomorrow, if not the day after it. Okay, so right now we're going up, so we can end this video on a beautiful view, which you will see now. Okay, so we are at the top. This is a little lake, I guess, which has... In total, three turtles. From what I've seen in this pond, there are three turtles. Here's a little dome-shaped statue thing. I mean, building. And here is one of the turtles. It has a red head. It's a red head turtle. Here is the view. Okay, see you on the next video. Bye bye.